Hello. Hi, my, my name is Lorinas. I am the founder of Co-Living Vilnius. And my name is Evgeny. I am uh, participating in uh, Erasmus for Young Entrepreneurs. I am the host in this program. I was also a new entrepreneur two years ago uh, where I went for a program in Portugal. It was a very good experience for me. It changed my life and I was staying there for well, six months and I decided to try the, being the host after getting the right experience in entrepreneurship and running my own projects. So, so far, it's a good experience. I suggest more people to try to be host entrepreneurs if they have the opportunity. In this case, Yevgeny, uh, we have him for one month helping on our project. He's having a, a good experience. Maybe you can tell me about your business idea, uh, what you had in Ukraine, why you came here and what was your experience? Yeah, sure. So actually my business plan was about co-working center, actually in Zaporizhia, it's Ukrainian city. And actually, uh, as I know, Lauren is doing some co-living uh, business in Lithuania. So my thing was about, you know, I can collaborate, you know, uh, co-working and co-living in uh, my uh, city. because. Uh, now it's not exist something like this in Zaporizhia, so I think it will be really, really popular for our people. And actually right now I, I'm doing some tasks for uh, Laurinos to exchange some experience from this task, which helps me in the future uh, when I, you know, I decide to open my own business. And actually for all of you uh, guys and everyone who participate in uh, Erasmus for Young Entrepreneurs, just uh, let's do it because it's a really uh, good possibility for you to improve your knowledge about business to, because uh, such a guy like Laurinas can help you to understand how it works, how it uh, need to be in something like this, you know. Yeah, so maybe I can talk a little bit about the project. So we opened the first co-living space in Lithuania and we call it Co-Living Vilnius. We already have one location and opening another one in two months. And the idea is that it's a place for young entrepreneurs and freelancers to live under the same roof where everyone is connecting to each other, inviting their own connections are not friends before they move in. They have common dinners at the same place where they stay. They also have the privacy if they want to stay in the bedroom. It's usually for those kind of people who want to live open style, uh, well, open mind lifestyle and who are really big fans of the shared economy. So that's what's uh, driving me because I want to live in such kind of place and it's been also tremendous experience. We have lots of co-working spaces in the area, but this was a little bit unique idea in the market which also gave us more motivation. I don't know, Yevgeny has an idea to open a co-living. I'm not sure how that's uh, going to happen and when, but I do believe that it was a good experience for you to do all the research of how, uh, uh, how to build a community, how to do a like-minded community awareness in the mm -hmm. social media. And what Yevgeny was working on our project, he uh, was doing a market research and preparing social media plan for our business and that's going to be presented on Friday when we're going to see how we can implement and see if, if there is any big long-term value from it. My suggestion for young entrepreneurs is to take advantage of such programs, try to go far away from your country, especially if you can, where you're going to have a completely different culture, meet different people, uh, meet international people, improve your regular skills and, and make a lifetime connections and maybe that will turn into business opportunities later. Yeah, sounds really good and actually I think now I can uh, do something new in my uh, country and actually in my city. I think this program you know, uh, gave me a chance to improve my knowledge about anything in business and Laurinas, uh, you helped me so much with this. Actually, and I'm really happy that you actually you my host because uh, you know so much in this uh, kind of business. Because uh, in my city, I do not met anyone who know so much uh, about co-living or just about co-working, for example. And so maybe it gives yeah. you more confidence of taking advantage, taking risks, and run your own business one day. Yeah, I really want to <laughs> run my own business because you know. It's really, it's really boring to work on someone, you know, it's, I, entire my life I want to uh, open something by myself 
and actually I think now I think that uh, co-living is perfect uh, opportunity to me to uh, open in Zaporizhia because it's something new so yeah I think it will be so bye see you all